overslept. I'm not going to make it in time. It's the last day of school. It's finals. Oh, you know, I only have two classes today and I'm acing both of them. So even if I got a zero on my finals, I still get like a B minus C plus. All good. Oh, it's been the most insane month of my life. First the thing with dad, and then Anna and I broke up. I've been picking up extra shifts at the restaurant. I've just been so drained. Every day is just like blending together. I didn't even realize it was Monday. Tyler, your football scholarship requires a 3.5 GPA. Oh. Are you sure? Jesus, I have it all figured out. <laughs> I woke up and all my muscles in my back and neck were so tense. Like the coaches made me do three Oklahoma drills back to back. Mm. Yeah, so I did the math and I figured I could afford a day off. And when I realized that, all the tensions in my muscles just kind of went away. So I think it was my body telling me that I needed some time off of school and yeah, take the day off. Hmm. So, Mom, what about you? You want to play hooky with me? Oh, God, I wish. <sighs> when was the last time you took a day off? And it doesn't count when you're working here at the house. <sighs> oh, my God. You can't remember, can you? I was just thinking that I, uh, I must have really passed along the workaholic gene to you. You know, your grandfather was a workaholic. Always, always had an obligation. That's, <sighs> you know, I barely like to spend any time with him when I was your age. So, what are we going to do about it? <sighs> yeah, I never called to work. Never. And Mr. Hubert, he always praises me for being the most dependable in the office. I can't let him down. Mom, I need you. Please, just spend the day with me. We're gonna go camping. Camping? Yeah, Dad used to take me to Bear Mountain. I know the trail's like the back of my hand. It's amazing up there. Come on, we'll go swimming, fishing, hiking. We can make s'mores by the fire. It'll be perfect. All right, why don't we go this weekend? I already have off on Friday. No, let's go today. I can't keep pushing off my free time. It never works out. Yeah, you know, you just... I know what the weather's gonna be like. Oh yeah, and it's perfect. Not a cloud out in the sky. We'll be able to see Cassiopeia, you know, mm -hmm. the queen or whatever, the mm -hmm. constellation. Mm -hmm. Please, come on. Ah, uh, well, all right. Yes, okay, right. awesome. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll get us all packed up. Uh, yeah, get ready. I'll get, you know, things. I'll pack everything, okay? Put yours back here? No, huh? No, no, it's small. Just, just shut it out and let's get in the car and go. Okay, yeah, um, yeah, just, you get in and I'll get in behind you. <laughs> Not behind you, just, uh, get in. Alright, don't see Yeah, you did a great job. You know, I ran into um, Sharon, Jonathan's mother, the other day jogging. You guys used to be really close. What happened to you two? Oh uh, yeah, well, we're still friends, pretty close. Yeah, he was a he was a cute boy. <laughs> yeah, he uh, he used to think you were hot too. <laughs> He'd be like, dude, your mother is so hot. <laughs> mm. Yeah, where? the best of my ability of impersonating him. Mm. <laughs> but he's good. He's a good guy. Yeah, I always thought it was so cute how nervous he would act around me. You could tell with all his stammering and stuff. 
It's adorable. Yeah, well, <laughs> I didn't think it was as cute as you did. You know, come on, having my friend think that my mom was hot, but mm -hmm. I don't know, I'm older now, and I guess I kind of get it. You know, mm -hmm. you're a teenager when you had me, and you are beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm just, yeah, I'm sure other guys see it too. I suppose. So is that why he doesn't come around the house anymore? <laughs> no, it's just, you know, we get along still and everything. It's just we've kind of grown a little apart. You know, he's a musician, smokes tons of weed, and mm -hmm. I'm into sports and take advanced classes. And, yeah, I guess I would say I'm a little socially inept. <laughs> but, we're, no, we still get along fine. Mm. Yeah. Mm. He's lost a little bit of interest in things, but, yeah, whatever. Yeah. I think that's what happened to your dad. No, that red-headed personal trainer ruined everything with Dad. You know, you realize that your father and I met when we were, like, really, really young. You know, kids shouldn't be having kids. But you did come along, and you were absolutely the most precious gift that I've ever been given in my life. So, what did you say about me dating him? Why, do you have someone in mind? <laughs> no! God, no! <laughs> but, you know, Sharon, she's been divorced for a while, so she's doing this online dating thing, and she seems really happy about it. I think I would be happy maybe dating again, too. You know, it's just a silly idea. Most people hey, my age is married. No! <laughs> Mom, come on, you could pass for someone in their 20s. You are only saying that because you're my son. <laughs> Simple as that. Come on. Mom, have you looked at yourself in a mirror lately? We're camping. There you... are no mirrors out okay, here. Okay, okay, but everyone at school knows you as being the hot mom. <laughs> like... <laughs> oh, please. You had way too many hormones. Yeah, just mm. delusional. Well, you know, if dating's going to make you happy, then you should go for it. I think it would. I think it would make me really happy. And you know, Sharon, she's gonna introduce me to the, her her photographer friends, and he's inexpensive. And uh, yeah, I'm excited. For what? For my profile pic. I want to look perfect. What are you talking about? You know what? The light's perfect out here now. How about I just uh, take a few pictures with my cell phone? It'd be like the same thing. I don't need a photographer person. Really? Guy. Target? No, come on. How about this? Wait, 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 wait. My hair, come on. <clears throat> oh, here. Are you sure? Get into a pose. Uh, okay. Yeah. Hold Let me on. Set this up. Mm. Oh, we have the fire oh. in the foreground too. Well. All right. Mm. Do oh. I? Do I look natural? Yeah, you're fine. What are you talking about? I don't want to look too like I'm trying too hard. Yeah, you're fine. Direct me. You're good looking, mom. Just... Can you there even you go. see me through the screen? You hold still. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to turn around. I will. Looks like you're talking to me. There you go. See? Try that. Oh, just go behind the bush. I'll turn around. It's kind of dark out here. I can't see anything. Wait, where's the bush left? In my backpack. Uh, I, I'll just turn around and go right there. Don't look. I'm not gonna look. Uh, stay turned around. Done? Yeah, I'm done. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna turn around now. Woo. Yeah. Woo. Ah, camping is wild. Oh, goodness. <laughs> um, is, is everything okay? Yeah. Honey, it's okay. <laughs> Don't you be embarrassed. It's okay. It's natural. I'm pretty embarrassed. <laughs> well, it's okay. Listen. It's natural. Your, your body doesn't know that I'm your mother, okay? It's just something that's going to happen. Nothing to do. Natural thing. 
Yeah, but it's kind of weird. I, I saw you jogging yesterday, and you are wearing a ponytail, which I've never seen you do, and uh, didn't know it was you. I, uh, either way, I was running behind you, and I started jogging up. I thought you were just a girl in the neighborhood, until I got a little closer, and I realized it was you. And uh, it threw me off. So, why didn't you say anything like, hello, while you were right behind me? I was scared. Scared of what? Was, <laughs> I'm your mom. Scared that the fact that it was like the first time I saw you as a woman and not as my mom. I don't mm. know. I just uh, I saw you in a sexual way and I had these fantasies. Tell me. Well, I had fantasy of this very moment this morning and it excited me so much I couldn't go to school. So, uh, did you fantasize about this conversation? Yeah. What happens next? <laughs>